outfit of the day and my boyfriend's not filming this one so it might be a little bit weird because I'm gonna have to keep coming up to pull down the camera but that's okay because I had a lot of coffee so I will edit this up kind of immaculate I hope so uh, because some people were commenting on my editing skills saying that it wasn't good but hey I am not a computer nerd I wish I was because it would make my life a lot easier and I wouldn't have to go around asking several different people but yeah, so anyways, the outfit of the day. So starting from the top, I guess I'll start off with my earrings because that is from the top. Oh, first, the um, hair extensions. Our Raquel Welch hair extensions are awesome. I just have them in a ponytail. Um, and then I have like my little choppy layers hanging out. And my earrings. This one is from Jewel Mint. Um, it's just the, like, the ones with the stars that I really love. The vintage ones. You can get 50% off. Um, if you enter the code video, all the important information will be down below. And then this one is from H&M. And the reason why I'm wearing a bigger one on one side and a smaller one on the other side is because that is the current trend in jewelry fashion right now. If you have one bigger earring and one smaller earring. So I decided to wear all silver accessories today. Um, so therefore, the big chunky silver one on the left side and the smaller one on the right side. And I always love everything on the left side. I don't know why. Um, it's probably because my bangs kind of fall on my right side, so I always like to put everything that's chunkier and bigger on the left side. So, yeah. And then my scarf is from Jacob, and my shirt is also from Jacob. It's just an oversized, um, crop top sweater thingy. And so moving right down, I have these TNA leggings on. They're like my favorite all-time leggings. And I have my Michael Kors Bromley boots on. This is last year's model, um, so it's... A lot more fitted in the calf, which is what I really like. This year's model is wider in the calf, and it also has a slightly larger heel. Um, but I really like last year's model. And I got them from Browns, and it has a really nice, strong, silvery zipper, which I absolutely love. And they're so comfortable. They did hurt when I first bought them, but they're really comfortable now. So that was my outfit of the day. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please let me know how you liked it in the comment section. And... Also, um, check out my other channels. You can go on my homepage, um, youtube.com slash superstar. You can go on that and um, on my banner, they have links to like my fitness channel, my boyfriend's channel, my blog. And I'm going to be opening up a vlog channel soon. So I will let you guys know when that happens. And yeah, so here is the makeup tutorial. So I already primed my lids with my NYX eyeshadow base and then I'm going to be taking Crystal Avalanche by MAC. It's just a shimmery white and I'm going to use that as my highlight color in my inner tear duct so that our eyes look a lot more open and we look more awake. And then I'm going in my NARS Okinawa palette. This was from last year and I'm going to go from the shades lightest to darkest on my lids. So on my lid I'm going to start off with the black and I'm just going to start off by really just smudging that color in and you want to pack it on as well so that you have a nice dark opaque um, black look and then just blend it in slightly with that uh, crystal avalanche so you don't have that definite line in between the two and then I'm going to go into the really pretty rich navy blue and start to blend that right above the black and into the black you don't want a definite line from the black so I'm just gonna mainly just blend it in so that we have that navy blue iridescence but you want the main focus to be on the black eyeshadow. So just keep on blending and working it in and also extend it out if you'd like. And then I'm going to go into that silvery color and just smudge that right above all those colors. Just really focus on blending it in and blending out those colors so that you have a nice smooth transition to your highlight. And then I'm taking a white Rimmel matte eyeshadow and just placing that underneath my brow bone to make them look a little bit more defined. And then I'm just going to take that navy blue and black mixed and just apply it on my lower lash line and then line my top lash line with a felt tip liner by Physicians Formula. And then I'm using MAC Smolder for my inner rims and then I'm just going to deepen up that black just a little bit. And then I'm using my new favorite mascara to apply several coats of mascara to my top and bottom lashes. And I love this mascara so much. It's awesome. And that is your finished eye look. So it should look something like that. As you can see, you have that nice navy blue color kind of popping through. And then I'm going to take MAC Eversun, which is a peachy shimmery color, and just tap it onto my cheeks, just like so. 
and then blend it out just a tad bit. And I'm going to erase my lips with my NYX primer and apply my lip infatuation in Angelic right onto my lips. So this will just plump my lips and also just add a nice pink sheen and it goes great with this look. So I hope you guys enjoyed this makeup tutorial. I hope you try it out. Subscribe if you're not subscribed and thumbs up if you liked it. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Please leave all requests down below. Bye! Yeah.